name is Victoria. Hi, I'm Alana. I'm Sherry. And today we're going to make a tinker tray using open-ended materials. So open-ended materials are just little loose parts that don't have a predetermined use or purpose for them, but it invites the child to um, open up their own imagination and decide what that part is going to be used for. Great, and there are different kinds of tinker trays that you could make. Uh, some trays can be used to collect collage materials and then you give the child some paper and glue or some contact paper that's sticky and they can just take things out of the tray and stick them down in whatever kind of configuration they like. The tray. And you can find all of these items either out in the nature like rocks and leaves and sticks or you could find them at any sort of craft store, the dollar store, you know, just just something easy like that. You don't have to work very hard to try and find these items. Mm -hmm. So, what do you guys think we should use? So, something that attracts me is something shiny, so I'm going to <laughs> use these jewels here. And I'll be putting them, there's two different colors, there's a red and then there's a, there's a clear, so I'm going to be putting both colors together and then Raina can take a look and use her imagination and figure out which color she likes better. I'm going to choose some toothpicks and straws. I'd like to see if uh, Raina would like to experiment with sticking them into the styrofoam and see if she comes up with some. So we are going to finish filling this up and we'll see you guys in a few seconds. There's lots of cool little things in there. So we're going to go ahead and invite Raina to play and we'll see where her imagination takes her. Maybe blue things on, whatever you like. You want to play with this? multi-purpose <laughs>
our tutorial on how to make a tinker tray and how to interact with the child while they're playing with the tinker tray. And as you can see, it's for this age group, it's very much about the sensory. So she's touching and feeling all the different textures. A couple of times she said shiny or soft. So she's also using the sight and you hear her say, her that referring to the noise that the materials are using. So at this age, yeah, great job. That's great. So at this age, it's very much about uh, embracing all of her senses in one activity. As toddlers love to have their whole body and whole being in doing whatever it is that they're doing. and we hope that you take this video as an opportunity to make your own tinker trays and now you can see how easy it is and how much they like it. Thanks for watching.